you want me to attack you, I can attack No, you cannot. No, you cannot. And I guarantee you won't. Oh, yeah? You just won't. You can either stop recording or you're going to have to leave the building because the employees don't want you here. I'm not going to stop recording because I'm just not going to. It's it's my constitutional right. Things work. I didn't say you're a threat. I said I don't know if you're a threat, but you're recording video in an area that is what supposed is to be... Did you talk to the police department? Oh, the police department's on their way? Great. Hey, what's up guys? Long Island Audit here. Back again with another video. Today we are at the BG Hendricks State Office Building here in Fort Smith, Arkansas. We are here today as always to peacefully exercise our First Amendment right to film in public and publicly accessible areas, to promote transparency and accountability within our government, and to ensure that our public servants recognize our rights and treat us with respect. Let's get into it. All right, guys, so we're just getting inside the state office building here. Let's take a look around. So I believe this office here in the state building is their Department of Labor. Let's just take a look around. Some computers over here to our right. Is there something in particular you need? Why are you videoing? Excuse me, ma'am? I'm sorry, you videoing? Yeah, I'm taking some pictures and video. That's I great. Thank you. Um, I'm an independent journalist who's working on a story. Oh, okay. Thank you. Can I help you, sir? Um, who are you, ma'am? I work for the state. I'm working here. You work for the state in what capacity? I'm a RACI employee. And your name? What can I help you with, sir? Oh, I don't need any help. I just wanted to know who you were since you came up to me. And... Oh, I was just asking your video in the office. So I was just trying to ask if we could do to assist you. Oh, no. I don't need any assistance whatsoever. Thank okay. you. Appreciate it. Hey, how you doing, sir? Hey, how are you? Good. Can I help you with something? Um, no. Who are you? Um, security here. I just asked him to help. I was told you're up here video people and asking like. Yeah, can I get names? your name? Uh, for what purpose? I'd like to know who I'm speaking to, especially Mike. When... Mike. My yeah. name's Sean. Mike. Okay. Um, just take us a picture and video of the facility here. For what purpose? Um, I explained to her already, but it's an, um, an independent journalist and is gathering content for a story. Okay, what kind of story? Can I can I ask what it's about? I can't divulge what it's about because it might compromise the story when it's published. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I don't see how that does that, but okay. Oh, it's that's true. It might compromise the story if I told you what it was about. Exactly. Okay. All right. Well, I would appreciate it if you don't bother the. Oh, I'm not bothering anyone. Okay. Just sure. Yep. Yeah, I'm not bothering anyone. Okay. You have a good day, sir. Make sure you tell everybody not to bother me, too, okay? Why are you video? Excuse me, ma'am? Why are you video? Who, who are you? I'm the supervisor here. Supervisor, and your name? Why? I just like to know who I'm speaking to. The we same way that you're. Video in here. The, the, sa the same way that you're speaking to me, I, and asking me what I'm, what I'm doing, I'm asking you who you are. Well, I don't want you video. Uh, okay, so I, that, you made that clear. You don't want me recording. Okay. Hey, how are you? Hey, you guys can't be recording anybody in here talking to people, asking them what they do here. I'm not talking. I don't want to talk to them. People keep talking to me. Maybe you should talk to them about okay. talking to me. But I, I actually seen you and heard you talking to somebody. what their name, what they do here while video, just because Bec she asked you what you were doing. When, when, people, when people come up to me, I ask them what their name and their title is. Same way I'm going to ask you what your name and title is, sir. So what is your Hi, reason? how are you? What is your reason for doing this? Hi, Give me who, an answer. Hi. No, no. Whoa. Well, relax. I, I don't first. owe you an answer. I don't owe you an then answer. I don't owe you an answer either. So, okay. Right. Can I get you your name, sir? play fair? We can play fair. I, that, I don't see how that makes sense. Here's how it's going to go. You can either stop recording or you're going to have to leave the building because the employees don't want you here. And I've been done talking Can I get your name, sir? You're making people uncomfortable. I don't have to give you my name. I'm just security just, here at the state. We're building. just asking you to please... So you stop recording. I'm not going to stop recording because I'm just not going to. It's it's my constitutional right. I do have business here. You have what is your business here? I do have business here. You can record anywhere out outside out of the property, but you cannot be inside the building. I can record inside the building. That is for sure. I'm not harassing anyone. I'm not bothering anyone. People are coming up to me, bothering me. Excuse me. You're gonna have to leave. Because if you don't leave, you are I'll obviously have to leave bothering this everybody because everybody's wondering why you're doing this. And I explained to at least three different people why I'm doing okay, it. Explain it to me. You said you're making a well, I don't know who you are. Explain it to me. I have no idea who you are. 
I've explained it to you. I've explained it to no, two other people exactly what I'm doing here. That, that is not a, when, or, or, That's not what I said, actually. But okay. you can that, ask a exactly simple question, and you cannot give an answer. I've answered three your, different people, and I don't even have to answer anyone. I don't have to. Sir, I didn't come up to you. I don't want to play games with you. I didn't come up to you, sir. You're escalating the situation. You're causing a disturbance. I asked you a simple, direct question that you cannot. But answer. you're coming up to me, sir, and I'm not. I, I didn't come up to you. Okay. I, didn't, I don't know who you are. Are you going to leave, or do I need to get the police down here? Sir, you can call whoever you need to call. Normally, law enforcement enforces laws. There's no law being broken here, sir. We have regulations. They don't have to be laws. You have regulations. We have to keep our place secure. What, we don't what know about what it? You're doing here. I've explained it three times to people who have identified that. that to me. Who are you that Why I need to I explain need to it to you? you? I am so that you can. Tell Why do I need to tell you what I'm doing? Why? It goes Why? both ways. Why do because I need to explain you to you what I'm doing here? Doing something that nobody else does. We have to keep our place secure. Okay. Do keep you it secure. There is there is personal private information. Why do you think there is security documentation? What do you think that word comes from? It's, I'm sure security is here to keep. The exactly. area secure, yes, exactly. Not from, not from, here, not from peaceful, not from peaceful citizens. Here. Yeah, I don't You're need being to. Peaceful, yes, but the main issue here is that there's personal, private information being discussed here, and you're this recording. This is a place of business. You know, nobody comes in here. That's illegal. You cannot record we personal, don't know who private you are. information. We don't know what your credentials are. Or documentary for who? For your TikTok. I have no, I, I have no idea what your credentials are either, sir. I don't. I work here. Okay, and I work for myself. Well, I work for myself. What is your business here? I've ex here I've explained it. I've explained it for any of these services. I've explained it many times, sir. You have many, not many times. That to me. You have avoided it. Again, that. I do. I am asking you, why are I have, you here? The reason why I'm not what explaining it to you. What is your business here? The reason why I'm not explaining it to you, sir, is because you have refused over and over again to identify yourself why to do me. I need to identify because you are a public servant, sir. That's why you need to identify well, yourself to me. You are not. You are not only a public servant. You're a public servant who is attacking me, sir. I'm He's attacking. Not attacking you. You. Yeah, you. Are you, are, you. By keep on saying by 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 harassing me and saying, oh, what, are "What are you doing here? What are you doing here? What are you doing here?" I wasn't here bothering you. What we are doing here. You came from your desk to you need come to, to turn me. This situation around. You are harassing us. Why are you recording? I wasn't even what speaking to any of you. Here? You are not here for any of the services that we provide. You have no business. I wasn't here. here. I wasn't even wanting to speak to anyone. Then what the hell are you doing here? See, look, you're escalating the situation. I, of course I'm escalating it. What is your business here? What is your purpose here? I've ex why don't you explain <clears throat> it to him since I explained explain it to you? Because obviously I'm I explained it to you, right? No Did I not tell you my name and what I'm doing here? Online journalist writing some kind of See, this, 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 goes, this, this, proves, this proves a point that no one listens when, when somebody's trying to. No, you you ask what I'm doing here, but you don't even literally listen to what I say, right? Just because I don't remember the exact words. It happened two minutes ago. I don't ago. understand what you're trying to do. So, okay. But the situation We have a issue. procedure where we can allow people in to explain what we do and how it gets done, etc. That's easy. It's been a while since that's happened, but nobody really comes and does Are it. you a supervisor here? I am not. So what, I, I, I just, I don't Why understand. does it have to be a supervisor? Why can't I come to the front lines and defend what we're doing here? I mean, you're defending it from the wrong person. I'm. Yeah. Why? Because I'm not a threat to anything here. I've not but shown that I'm a threat. That. We don't know what you're going to do with this. You cannot just say that we don't know you're a threat, so you automatically are a threat. That's not how these things I didn't work. I said you're a threat. I said I don't know if you're a threat, but you're recording what video my, in an area that is supposed is to be. Did you talk to the police department? Oh, the police department's on their way. What Great, I appreciate that. Here? I appreciate what that. What is your business with this office? I've already explained it, sir. You have not explained it to me. Can you, if you identify yourself to no, me, I will, ex I, I will identify myself. So I don't have to do it either, sir. What's I told you my name already. And if you can't tell me what you're doing here, then you have no right to be here. I do have a right. And is I this a public right building? To get you out of here. Is this a public building? Yes, it is. Okay, so there I have a right a to be that here. Security which you're not receiving in this building. I don't. Whenever we my business is not to receive services. It's we call security to escort you off the premises. Which means I'm not loitering. Loitering would come in here and just not do anything. You're Obviously, it does not. What does make sense? You're just seeing now you're not I'm not asking here. anyone you're any you're questions. Why you're asking questions. Why they work here? Who they you are. guys are like, I don't understand. You guys are you're, you're attacking me for what? I, they don't have a choice on whether who can come in and cannot. So what is, 
No, you yeah, will you not. You want me to attack you? I can no, you cannot. No, you cannot. And I guarantee you won't. Oh, yeah? Just won't. Just won't. Come on. Take it down. You want to escalate? We can escalate this. Escalate whatever you want. I'm trying to de-escalate, but you can escalate whatever you want, and I'll be here for it. Okay? What Thanks. What is your business here? State the police, police should remove right this man from the building. No. no yeah. Either you should be removed from the building. Right. Because you're the one causing, you you're disturbing the peace. What threat am I? You just said that you that if you want, if I want you attack me, you attack me. Words as threats. No, Fine. he just had to calm you down because you you obviously can't control your own emotions. Because they know what I'm capable of. <laughs> I don't think you're capable of much okay. of anything, right. except right. maybe just talking. That's a, that's all you are. All talk. I don't want. To, I don't want to. I don't want to fight with you. State your business no, here. You're, you're trying. I don't even want to speak to any of you. you I'm gonna wait for the. I'm waiting for law enforcement. I don't need to turn the camera off, sir. This is a constitutionally protected activity. Actually, Do you understand that? For your where private information there is no private information you here. Yes, fought for is. your rights, me. They do. Okay? If you fought, so, then you should be upholding them. Number one, above everyone. I'm not a law enforcement officer. I don't okay. care for that. Okay. I fought for my rights and yours, and oh. I'm not going to jump okay. on that. Okay. All right. I understand that you have that. What I want to know is what is your business in this office? I've did you request to come in and do I did that? not I didn't there request. There are procedures in place for that. Yep. I didn't request. I tried to communicate that. To I you. didn't request to come in anywhere. It was my mistake, I guess. I thought this was a public building, is it not? It is. Okay, then I have a right to but be here. People, have but I have a right to have enter. I have a right to be here to conduct business that this office conducts. Yeah. If you do not have anything to do with any of the services that we provide, what are you doing here? Loitering. No, exactly. not loitering. Yes, I told not, you. All it's not loitering. Just yeah, because you say it's loitering. You reasonably asked to, to leave the premises. Yeah. It's not loitering. Yes, it is. That it's is not the loitering. Very I've loitering. literally told you my purpose. I just told you my purpose five minutes ago. Not the reason why. We got an officer. Great. I can't wait to talk to the law enforcement officers. Hopefully, they educate you guys here today and we can move on. And I'm going to be the one that's going to educate. Okay. Hey, if the cops aren't, if the law enforcement officers aren't educated, then maybe, maybe they will uh, violate my rights. Let's see, but they will be held accountable, and just like you guys are going to be held accountable. Yeah, law enforcement. Hi, hey, sir. How are you? Okay. Sure. Who are you, sir? I'm sorry. I'm the manager, Tom Bonkowski. Tom. Nice to meet you, Tom. Let's have a seat. Let's figure out what's going on. Sure. Yeah, I have no problem talking to you. What can we do for you? Hey, Tom. So, my name is Sean. I'm an independent journalist. I'm just gathering some content for a story here in the publicly accessible areas, just documenting, you know, the brochures you have here and different things of that nature, only in the publicly accessible areas. Um, I'm not looking to do any interviews with any of your employees here. Um, I was confronted by several of them asking me what I was doing. I explained to them what I was doing. Right. They called security anyway, and now security is... Um, you know, trying to escalate the situation, and I'm trying to de-escalate this, and it's getting real out of hand now. Law enforcement's coming, and I'm just trying to exercise my rights of freedom of press here peacefully. Sure. That's it. Have you, how much more are you going to, I mean, what do you want to for talk, take pictures? Well, I was taking pictures of the, the brochures and everything that you guys have, and just, just to get a, a sense and idea uh -huh. what you guys accomplish here, and what services that you have openly ready for people to take, you know, applications, Things of that nature, and just the, the comings and goings of what's going on here. I'm that's glad all. to walk you around and show you what we have. Yeah, that's. I mean, that would be fine. I I would rather. I'm, I I want to wait for law enforcement at this time because I need to explain to them exactly what what's going on. So that way, I don't want them coming up behind me or anything. So I I appreciate that. And then if anybody else would have told me that, it would have been great. But you know, some people don't even want to identify themselves. So I don't really. I don't like. Saying, they're like, what are you doing? And I say, hi, how are you? What is your name? And they don't want to tell it to me. It becomes a big problem at that point. So sure. I, I'm just going to wait for law enforcement right now until they get here so I can talk to them. And then sure. we can have a discussion after that if you'd like. That's no problem. Thank you, Tom. I appreciate it. Hi, sir. How are you? Good. How are you? You mind if I get your name and badge number? Uh, David Williams, 4416. Thank you, Officer Williams. I appreciate it. What's going on? You got him, he's coming in, he's asking people who they are, what they're doing here, and he's recording people. We oh, asked him nicely to put a phone up, he refuses. I told him, well, he doesn't leave the building because I'm close to him. Who asked you to make him leave? 
So this is the manager over here, Tom, that I just spoke with. No, I'm not. You are you are such a liar. I am recording. Can I tell you what I'm doing here, sir? Sure. My name is Sean. I'm an independent journalist. I'm just taking some pictures of video in the publicly accessible areas of this public building here, uh, which is my constitutional right. And people have come up to me. Several people have come up to me, asked me what I'm doing. So I asked them, hi, how are you? My name is Sean. What's your name? What's your title? That's the context of how I'm talking to people. Um, the security guards p painting it in a way different picture. Um, yeah, and I, the, the manager, Tom, has no problem with me being here. So I don't understand. And I have a right to be here. I'm exercising my rights peacefully. I, I don't understand what's the issue here. I'm not... I'm not escalating the situation, I'm not causing a disturbance, and I'm not, um, you know, trying to interrupt business or anything. That's not my goal here. Uh, he's the manager over there. He is the manager. Okay. You guys listening? State building, public Sir, place. I'm talking, I'm talking to you. I don't give a crap. I'm not listening to you. I'm talking to you. State I'm building, wall, state listening. building. I'll, I'll talk to you. State building, public place. Don't escalate the situation. I have every right to be here and every right to record. And they have every right to tell you to leave. No. And leave. I guarantee I don't leave. Okay. I don't care what you guarantee. Okay. Guarantee you. Mm -hmm. We will see. I don't want to look. I, I don't know. We're, we're, we're past the point of you telling me what I'm going to do. No, I don't want to talk to you anymore, sir. You can talk all you'd like. You can't just escalate the situation and try and. I didn't yes, you did. Both of you did. You're the one that got defensive when I asked you what you were doing. No, sir, that's not true. That's not true. I know, and you're going to make sure to edit that video so it shows I mean, there's nothing to edit. Thank you, man. You have a great day. There's nothing to edit. Nothing whatsoever. Mm -hmm. I mean, I could take it all the way. I mean, he's right. I can't make it out of a public building right there. So, I mean, as long as he's up in here and he's not trying to film people's personal, it, personal stuff, offices, know? private offices, That's restricted I areas. Asked him not to film the computers, yeah, but yeah, he keeps turning the camera towards the computer. Yeah, I can ask people whatever questions I want, but I'm, that's not even my point here today. It's you can ask anybody anything, sir. I'm 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 out on this. Yeah, because sir, and I appreciate. Hey, listen, you're law enforcement, and I appreciate you not enforcing people's feelings here today. Thank you, sir. I appreciate you. You stay safe out there, okay? Walk of honor, and then two walk of shames. Incredible, Tom. Thank you, sir. Just want to shake your hand. Thank you for. You're treating me with respect. Sure. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah, there is the biggest I, concern was that uh, when we have clients in here and they're working on the computers, a lot of them have s sensitive information. And, yeah, and that's not my intention at all. That's not my intention to get any type of sensitive I mean, information. You know, but as far as materials and stuff like that. I yeah, mean, this I is a public it. space. I would just bring up to your attention, Tom, that there was an, a gentleman. He didn't. He didn't identify himself. <clears throat> Excuse me. He didn't identify himself to me, but. He said he wasn't a supervisor. I asked him if he was a supervisor. He came out here and was very aggressive towards me and you know, basically said, you know, if you want me to get, if you want me to, I'm like, listen, stop attacking me because I felt that he was attacking me with, you know, saying, what are you doing here? I'm trying to just want him to identify himself. And he said, if you want me to really attack you, I'll attack you. So it, it, it escalated to a point where it's not going to shine a good light on your office here when I publish my story. And you seem like a great guy and, you know, that you run, that you're fair. And I just would like it if you, I don't know his name to tell you, but I guess you'll see it in the video. He, I think that there be, should be some, you know, coaching involved in that scenario, in that yeah, situation. I'll talk with him when we get done. Thank you, sir. Appreciate your time. Hey, you have a great day, okay? Stay safe. Stay Thank you. Safe. Make sure you tell your partner you guys have the day you deserve, okay? Take care. Now you know for next, you know for next time. All right, guys, so we're just getting out of the B.G. Hendricks State Office building here in Fort Smith, Arkansas. 
So this audit started off okay. I have no problem with public servants coming up to me and asking me what I am doing or if I need any help. The issue arises when you do not identify yourself to me and show me the respect that I deserve because I treat everyone with respect. And if you identify, I will identify myself to you and tell you exactly what I'm doing. But it seems that even when I say my name is Sean and my purpose in the building, there are just some people that want to escalate the situation like the security guards and that unhinged public employee. You know, there was something off about that guy. I don't see how he is in public service. Thankfully, he is not a law enforcement officer because he would 100% let that authority go to his head and he would be a tyrant. I wish I knew his name so I can hold him accountable. We spoke to his manager, Tom, who was, you know, very pleasant, de-escalated the situation, sat down with me and had a one-on-one -on -one conversation, which we truly appreciate. But the two security guards, big Fs. DSI needs to train their officers better. Those officers had no idea about our constitutional rights, the First Amendment, public property, even though they work in a public building. Completely insane, trying to escalate the situation, letting their egos and their lack of knowledge get the best of them. Hopefully they got a good education here today and we can hold them accountable, everybody accountable. Shout out to the law enforcement officer who arrived, was very friendly, identified himself, did not enforce people's feelings because he is a law enforcement officer, not a feelings enforcement officer. So, big shout out to him and his department. Let me know what you think about this one in the comment section below. As always, stay safe. God bless. I'll see you in the next video. Long Island Audit. Peace.